simple interest. The formula I equals PRN, where P is equal to the principal, which is the amount invested, R is the rate of interest per period, and N is the number of periods. So that formula there, I equals PRN, you're going to use that for simple interest questions, sometimes referred to as flat interest. Okay, it means the same thing. Let's look at some examples. The first one, find the simple interest on $300 at 6% per annum for two years. Now always start with the formula firstly, I equals PRN. Now the $300, that's our principal, okay, so P equals $300. 6% per annum is our rate. So R equals 6%, and you need to be very good at writing rates as decimals. So 6% is 0 0.06 and two years, so n equals two. So using our formula, i equals p firstly, which is $300. We're multiplying by the rate, 0 0.06, and finally multiplying also by n, which is two years. And if we calculate that, it works out to be $36. Our second example, we're asked to find the simple interest on $4,000 at 3.5% per annum, for 18 months. Okay, it's a little bit different because this one's months. So firstly, the formula again, I equals PRN. $4,000 is our value for P. 3.5% per annum. Well, let's see what happens here. The rate is 3.5% per annum, but the 3.5%, okay, we write that as a decimal, so 0 0.035, but we're dealing with months. So what we need to do is divide that by 12, okay, because that was the rate per annum, per year. We need to divide by 12 to break it down to the rate per month, a very important step. And then the 18 months, well, that's what n equals, okay, so n equals 18 months there. Right, so here we go, i equals PRN, so i equals the principal, $4,000, multiplied by the rate, which is the rate per month, so we write that, 0 0.035 over 12 and multiplying by n, which is 18 months. We multiply by the 18. And if we calculate that, it works out to be $210. Excellent. Okay, well that concludes the lesson. Good luck with your questions.